hello guys welcome back to my channel so guys in the last video we have learned uh, about how to export OVF file or OVF file from here from VMware SXI console and uh, we have also deployed virtual machine from an OVF file in the last video so in this video we will learn about uh, how to create template VM template and how to deploy virtual machine from template uh, from vCenter or vSphere client so now I am going to log in here on my vCenter server VMware sphere vSphere I will enter uh, the last video's link in this video in this video uh, description box. So if you want, you can refer and watch that video for more information. Now I am going to log in here. So you can see here, uh, I have logged in successfully on my VM, VM vSphere client and uh, you can see here data center, I have created one data center and cluster and this is host IP that is 10.10.15, you can see here, you can see The IP is also showing here. You can see 10.10.15, and uh, this is ESXi host console. Here you can see there are three virtual machines on this host: vCenter server, DC, and test. And uh, if we'll check here, the same machines are also showing here in our VMware vSphere client: DC, test, and vCenter. So now we are going to learn here how we can create VM template, virtual machine template. So uh, one more thing I want to clear here, why will use template or why will create here template. So guys, if you have a template and if you want to deploy virtual machine, so you can uh, deploy virtual machine from template within two to three minutes or you can say you can ready new virtual machine from template or with the help of template within two to three minutes so you no need to uh, create fresh or new virtual machine from an ISO image or from any other image so let us see how we can uh, create template virtual machine template or convert virtual machine as a template so first we'll check if we are going to convert the virtual machine as template machine should be <coughs> shut down so here you can see DC is up V center server is up and test machine is shut down it is not running so we'll try to create this machine template you can see so I have right click here you can see template option there there is two option that is convert to template and another one is export OVF template so we have already uh, learned in last video uh, to how to export OVF templates so if you want you can export from here too from here also so now I am going to convert this as 
template so just click here it's asking convert the virtual machine test to a template click yes yes you can see here the result test completed vsphere.local and uh, means this machine is this virtual machine is converted as template so in future if you had to deploy any new virtual machine new vm then just you can use your template and you can deploy new virtual machine within two to three minutes let us check here first you can see test is not showing here means it is converted now as a template but here only virtual machines are showing so you can see template is showing here you can see the symbol of means you can say icon is changed virtual machine icon is looking like this and uh, template icon is looking minor different let us check how we can uh, deploy new virtual machine from template before going ahead i want to show you in esx console you can see here there is only two virtual machine and you can see the same machines are also visible here if you want you can check by going to data storage data store browser you can see here the test test is showing here that is a template now i am going to close this and let us try to deploy a new virtual machine with the help of template now i am going to right click here on the host name you can see a new virtual machine click here create new virtual machine deploy from a template so we are going to deploy machine through template so just will select this and and click next content library data center you can select this template from here click next new virtual machine name it's asking new virtual machine means you can new test vm you can enter the name as per your wishes click to next this is the host ip just click next and this is the data store and from this data store a virtual machine will use the space if you want you can change from here if you have any other storage otherwise click to next select a valid destination yes you need to select this click next customize the operating system customize this virtual machine hardware if you want any changes like uh, any customization in operating system or hardware so you can select this and go to next option and change otherwise if you want to deploy same configuration as template so just click on next 
you can see here the details of this new virtual machine which we are going to deploy source is test that is template name virtual machine name is new test vm which we have entered and folder name is data center host is 10.10.15 on this host machine will deploy now going to click on finish you can see here the status 39 percent 40 percent yes so guys you can see now the status is completed so as i already told you you can deploy a virtual machine within two to three minutes if you have a template you can see here the machine is showing here and this is in shutdown mode if you want you can check by uh, power on this machine by powering on there is no network assigned to this virtual machine yes because this is new host this is new virtual machine you can see if you want any other information data stores we'll check the same from here by going to more vms will check by refreshing this it is taking some time yes yes so you can see here the new test vm is showing here that means it is deployed successfully and the same thing you can monitor from here also this is also showing in vcenter vsphere client if you want you can check by start this machine it's getting a start if you will click on this it is it will ask for launch console web console i am going to launch this in web console it is starting So device is getting ready but it's taking some time because this is new virtual machine yes guys you can see that this machine is started now so in this way you can uh, deploy new virtual machine from template and I hope now it is clear to you how you can uh, create template and how you can deploy a new virtual machine with the help of template so guys i hope this video will be helpful for you so request you to please subscribe my channel for new upcoming videos and uh, click on bell icon so that you can get notification and if this video will be really helpful please share with your friends thanks bye bye